Black Sea is instrumental for making the whole of Europe peaceful and future-oriented. Sadly, Black Sea is also a showcase of how rapidly things can deteriorate if one neglects threats. Dear Dmitro, I'm very glad to see you online. We need to address the common Russia problem together. For instance, I support the expert idea to integrate the air and missile defense systems of Ukraine with the ones of the Black and Baltic Sea NATO allies. If we trace this aggression back to its very origins, the upcoming NATO summit in Vilnius is the right time to correct mistakes of the past by taking resolute step forward on the path to Ukraine's NATO membership to show that the door is not only open, but there is a clear plan on when and how Ukraine will enter it. I assume we all understand now that fear is not a strategy. It is time to work out a comprehensive security network for all nations on, of the region that feel threatened by the maniac on the loose. It's time to turn Black Sea into what the Baltic Sea has become, a sea of NATO. Thank you so much, uh, Dmitro, and I'm, uh, I'm looking forward to the visit. Um, we all want peace. Peace in full respect of the sovereignty and territorial integrity of Ukraine, in full respect of the UN Charter, and of the fundamental principles of international law. But negotiations can only start when Ukraine is ready, and the victory will look like in the way Ukraine will define it. Just as the Republic of Moldova, for Romania at national level it is more than clear Romania is doing a lot to strengthen Black Sea security for NATO and EU members and as well as for our partners, be it Ukraine, the victim of Russia's aggression, or for, as I previously said, the Republic of Moldova and Georgia, who are, after Ukraine, the most vulnerable to Moscow's pressures. Thank you.